A chance to meet some of the finalists in this year's New Zealand Book Awards. The Dunedin Public Library invited schools to hear from authors behind this year's best children's and young adults literature. Pauline Smith's book Dawn Raid follows a 13-year-old girl in the 1970s when Pacific Island families were sometimes the target of immigration officials. We had an economic downturn in the 70s so there were too many people, not enough jobs and it was easy for the government to target a group of people, particularly the Pacific Island people, as um, overstayers, which some of them were. However, two-thirds of the overstayers were from European countries and they didn't get dawn raided like the Pacific people did. While Smith never encountered a dawn raid herself, she has a good idea of how distressing the experience might have been. However, we did um, in the 70s have the immigration people knock on our door asking for my father's papers, so it's a sort of version of a dawn raid. So a dawn raid is when people are asleep in their bed in the middle of the night and the police burst in and shine lights in your faces and it's a bit tormenting and terrifying. Smith has run workshops with intermediate aged children and was impressed at how closely they read her book. I'm really amazed at how critically they can look at things and think about things and the strong opinions they have. They, they like having a cause and they like the idea that I can stand up and say what I think about something. She believes the secret to writing is everyone has a story to tell and even the most ordinary setting can make a good book. Sometimes that everyday, ordinary, mundane things that happen in your life, if you can explain them well, other people get it because they have those experiences too. The New Zealand Book Award winners will be announced next Wednesday on the 8th of August. In Dunedin, for the South Today.